It's a year of very great events. We attained our independence on the 1st of October. Sir Abubakar Tafar Balewa was born December 1912 in Bauchi State, the son of Bagheri Muslim District Head in the Bauchi Divisional District of Leri. He started early education at the Quranic School in Bauchi and like most of his contemporaries, he studied at the Katsina College for further education, where he acquired a teaching certificate. He returned to Bauchi to teach at the Bauchi Middle School in 1944, along with a few learned teachers from the North. He was chosen to study abroad for a year at the University of London Institute of Education. Upon returning to Nigeria, he became an inspector of schools for the colonial administration and later entered politics. He was elected in 1946 to the Colony's Northern House of Assembly and to the Legislative Assembly in 1947. As a legislator, he was a vocal advocate of the rights of Northern Nigeria and together with Sir Amadou Belu, Alaji Tafar Baliwa founded the Northern People's Congress, NPC. Tafar Baliwa entered the government in 1952 as Minister of Works and later served as Minister of Transport. In 1957, he was elected Chief Minister, forming a coalition government between the Northern People's Congress (NPC) and the National Council of Nigeria and the Cameroons (NCNC), led by Namdi Azikiwe. He returned the post as Prime Minister when Nigeria gained independence in 1960, and was re-elected in 1964. In 1961, the Balewa government created an official Foreign Affairs and Commonwealth Relations ministerial position in favor of Jaja Mwachuku, who became, from 1961 to 1965, the first substantive Nigerian Minister of Foreign Affairs and Commonwealth Relations, later renamed External Affairs. In January 1960, Baliwa was knighted by Queen Elizabeth II as a knight commander of the Order of the British Empire. He was awarded an honorary doctorate from the University of Sheffield in May 1960. His portrait adorns the five Naira notes. The Abubakar Tafar Baliwa University in Bauchi is named in his honor. <laughs> 